Hello everyone, welcome to Yellow Pages Nursing. Well, today's topic is about RAS scale, that is Richmond Agitation Sedation Scale. Before entering into the session, if you have not subscribed our channel, please subscribe our channel and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive instant notifications. Let's get into the session. RAS scale, that is Richmond Agitation Sedation Scale. It is a 10 point scale which helps to assess patient's level of anxiety or agitation, patient's level of alertness or calm, and patient's level of sedation. For anxiety or agitation, the scores given are from plus 1 to plus 4, and for alertness or calm, the score given is 0, and for levels of sedation, the scores are given in negative, that is minus 1 to minus 5. Let's discuss what is RAS scale used for? RAS is mostly used in the setting of mechanically ventilated patients in the intensive care unit to avoid over and under sedation. It's also used to assess the level of consciousness and agitated behavior in ICU patients. Obtaining a RAS score is the first step in administering the confusion assessment method in the ICU, which is a tool to detect delirium in the intensive care unit patients. RAS scale also helps to guide sedation therapy and improve communication of patient care between healthcare providers. Now, how long does it take? RAS assessment usually takes 30 to 60 seconds with three steps, that is observation, response to auditory stimulation, response to physical stimulation. This assessment is not suitable for patients with severe impairments like blind or deaf. Now, how frequently RAS assessment is done? RAS assessment should be checked and documented for every two hours for patients who are mechanically ventilated. Let's look into the scores and what does it denote. Score 0 denotes alert and calm, that is, patient spontaneously pays attention to caregiver. Next comes the four levels of anxiety or agitation. Score 1 denotes restless that is patient is anxious but movements are not aggressive or vigorous next score 2 that is agitated patient has frequent non-purposeful movements and fights ventilator next is score 3 which denotes very agitated that is patient pulls or removes tubes or catheters and is aggressive Next is score 4 that is combative, here patient is violent and is immediate danger to the staff. Now comes the negative score that is levels of sedation from minus 1 to minus 5. Score minus 1 denotes drowsy. Patient is not fully alert but has sustained awakening that is eye opening or eye contact to voice for more than 10 seconds. Next, score minus 2 it denotes light sedation. Patient briefly awakens with eye contact to voice for less than 10 seconds. Score minus 3 denotes moderate sedation. Patient has moment of eye opening to voice but no eye contact. Next is score minus 4 which indicates deep sedation. Here there is no response to voice but moment or eye opening to physical stimulation is present. Last is score minus 5 which denotes unarousable that is there is no response either to the voice or physical stimulation. Now let's discuss about the procedure of RAS assessment. First observe the patient. If the patient is alert restless or agitated the score ranges between 0 to plus 4. If the patient is not alert state the patient's name and say the patient to open eyes and look at the speaker. If the patient awakens with sustained eye opening and eye contact then the score is minus 1. If the patient awakens with eye opening and eye contact but not sustained then the score is minus 2. If the patient has any movement in response to voice but no eye contact then the score is minus 3.
In simple terms, this step involves checking patient's response in terms of verbal stimulation. Where minus 1 is the drowsy state that is not fully alert but has sustained awakening that is eye contact or eye opening to the voice for more than or equal to 10 seconds and minus 2 is light sedation where patient briefly awakens with eye contact to voice less than 10 seconds and minus 3 is moderate sedation where there is movement or eye opening to voice but no eye contact. Now, if the patient does not respond to voice then physically stimulate the patient by shaking the shoulders and or, or rubbing the sternum. If the patient has any movement to the physical stimulation then the score is minus 4. If the patient has no response to any stimulation, then the score is minus 5. For most of the patients, a RAS score of 0 to minus 2 is desirable. This is all about today's video regarding RAS, that is Richmond Agitation Sedation Scale. If you find this video useful, please like it and please subscribe it and do not forget to hit the bell icon to receive